So y'all remember I got my microchip in my hand and the hotel hooked it up and let me uh open the door with this shit. Fire. The latest breakthroughs. Turns out one of the biggest discoveries is actually this tiny. See how small that is? This little chip may be the next big thing, and it sounds like it's right from a sci fi movie, but people all over the world are implanting these into their wrists. So I asked my producer Dean to find out more about this cutting edge technology and what it could mean for your health. Next thing that's inevitably going to happen, and we want to be a part of it. The concept is pretty simple. Just like how you can buy something nowadays using your phone, what if you could use a microchip inside your hand instead? Todd, you're going to show us how this could potentially work. Yes, uh, basically what this is considered is a break room market in an office complex. We'll come up, scan the item, we'll hit pay with credit card, and it's asking to uh, swipe my proximity payment now. I'll hold my hand up just like the cell phone and uh, it will pay for my product. Instead of a credit card? Correct. Hand. Because my microchip is now my credit card. More than 53 square market employees are having them implanted starting next week. Not only can they buy stuff with them, they'll also be able to use the chips to get in the front door and log on to their computers. Each chip costs $300. The company's picking up the tab. The chip goes between your thumb and forefinger, and CEO Todd Westby says the data is both encrypted and secure. Not only can they buy stuff with them, they'll also be able to use the chips to get in the front door and log on to their computers. Each chip costs $300. The company's picking up the tab. The chip goes between your thumb and forefinger, and CEO Todd Westby says the data is both encrypted and secure.